Hello. Hello. So we are here with a sort of celebration stream for finishing Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn. Mm-hmm. Um, that sounds good. To okay, me. good. The yeah. background music can maybe be a tiny bit louder if we want to, but like it is just for the background. Yeah, so. that's uh, I I don't want it to be overpowering. Okay, no, then that should be fine. I will pop it up just a bit. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, so we're gonna be tier ranking some Fire Emblem games characters, um, and then some Hades characters as well, just because we want to. Mm -hmm. Um, I mean. <laughs> Oh, have you just noticed the executive decision I've made? Yeah, I, I, I only just realised what you had done. I expected that this was going to happen. And I think that maybe for each one, should we have like a free overrule for like one character? Because sure. you might need to use yours on Duke Oliver. But actually, no. He's a le he's he's a legend. He's brought us a lot of joy. I mean, we've we've gotten so much enjoyment out of Duke Oliver. <laughs> I think a lot of times the S tier ones. I remember this for uh, when we did our three houses ranking. It's just the ones that have like brought us that spark joy. Spark joy. That's how yeah. the Renshelm and Gloucester and Hubert rank so highly. Well, yeah. Um. Okay. Well, that seems fair and good. Now, I think so. how, now let's rank the rest of these lesser characters. These lesser mortals, uh, oh. so to speak. Speaking of, no, Ashura is not on the list. Mm. Uh, nor is Yune. Okay, that's interesting given some of the randoms that are on I this know, list. Oh, yeah. It's a, they've made <laughs> some slightly eclectic choices, I will say. Um. But yeah, so should we start from the first one? It's a bit, it's not order as well, but... It's alphabetical. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, well, in that case, we will kick off with... Oh, I should say, actually, there will be spoilers for these games. Yes. Just by virtue of all the characters being there, but also we've played them all, we've finished them all. There's I'm... probably going to be some spoils. Oops. Yes, oh, by... I'm going to pop that in the... Um, the oh, okay, actually. cool. Um, so, like, for Almeida, I do quite like her. I don't really know. I guess I'm feeling maybe around a sort of B or C. I would say she's a B. I was almost considering tipping her over into an A because, like, I do think she is an interesting character. Oh. Um, and, like... <laughs> I know you had this, that the, the more the game goes on, the more you get to know her, the more you actually do find her quite, uh, quite an interesting character, so... B, I think B, I think then. B, I think yeah. we I think we're, we, we seem to be talking as if she should be, be in... Should be in B, B in B. B. <laughs> yes. Um, Amy? Amy is her name, yes. I'll tell you what. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> wow, we're getting... Are we... No. Okay. Yeah, I think that's a good a good addition. Yeah. Um. So then we have Aaron. Mhm. Mm um. Oh, just to clarify, question mark, question mark, question mark doesn't mean like we don't know who the character is. It's more just we have no information to base a decision on. Really. Although once we get to fates, it might be who we don't know who they are. Yeah. Okay. So Aaron. Um. So, the fact that his portrait does look like him moving a single earbud mm. has brought me a lot of joy. Um, mm. But that's the only thing, really. <laughs> so, maybe like a C? I think he's a, he's a C, yeah. Yeah. Um, Astrid. Ah, that's her name, yes. Maybe also a C? I think she's probably a C, yeah. Maybe, mm. I, I'm very neutral on her. Okay, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> now, I actually like Bastion more than you do. I know so. you do. Not a whole lot. Well, probably a, a decent amount more in that I don't dislike him. He does have a character that, like, is distinctive. I just yeah. also, I just happen to find him, like, quite annoying. Um, but I think that that is just because his personality rubs me up the wrong way. It's not that he just doesn't have a personality. So mm. maybe like another, maybe a B. You know what? Okay, I, wow, I push that, him to a that's B. That's generous. 
Well, the thing is, I, I have an opinion on oh, him. Oh, that's true, yeah. And I think he is kind of like, I do find him funny, but I'm also just kind of like, get stressed imagining hanging out with him. I mean, that makes sense. Now for the next one, <laughs> this is where the spoilers come in, because I will point out that the Black Knight and Zelgius are listed separately. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> seems weird, but okay. Um, I like, I think the Black Knight, probably B. Yeah, well, that makes sense. Black Knight. Uh, yeah, I, I really like the Black Knight as an antagonist. Yeah, um, I think he's like, he's interesting. As And I like his sort of strange mix of motivations in Radiant Dawn in particular. Mm. I mean, we can talk probably talk about him a bit more as a character when we get to Zelgius. But... Mm. Okay, so Boyd. Uh, see, I have some residual fondness for some characters from Path of Radiance, but mm. then that's often like distinct from how they are in Radiant Dawn. Mm. Boyd isn't one where this is so much of a problem, but the will come to some yeah. at least where mm. I really like them from their role in Path of Radiance, but they have nothing to do. Yeah. I think maybe a C or a B for Boyd. I was going to go for another B, to be honest. Yeah, um, let's go for B for Boyd. Let's do it. He's a fun boy. Duh. Mm. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Rom. Uh, amusing. Mm -hmm. Um, maybe a, maybe a B. I, you... I certainly like him better than Aaron and Astrid, who are our kind of C yes. level at the moment. Okay. Oh. <laughs> big, big red boy. Oh. Um, maybe an A, honestly. I think probably an A, I just because he's so fun to have in the Tower of Guidance. And yeah. I do quite just quite like him as a character as well. Khalil. Uh, D. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Danved. Oh, is he? No, they haven't listed him. Dev Dan, separately, <laughs> no. Because he would be immediately after. Um, okay. Um... Probably like a C. I think he's probably a C based on who I don't put a C already. Actively dislike him, but there's also not that not so much to him that I'm like feel particularly strongly. Yeah, Diginci, Digincia, I think it is Digincia. We we said Diginci for like the whole playthrough and then found out at the eleventh hour that the yeah. like, narrator says it differently. Um. I think he is interesting, but he's mm. not in the game that much, no, which is the not. only thing that's making me think maybe a C rather than a B. I would have put him in a B. I mean, to be fair, Canigus isn't in the game very that's much. True. Yeah, let's go for a B then. Yeah. Keeping the dragoons together. Edward. Oh, maybe a B. I was going to say I think he might be an A. Oh, okay, interesting. Uh, just I, li I like him quite a bit as a character, and he is super useful, especially in the early stages of the game. Mm. Um, so for me, I think he's probably an A. For me, he is a B, but... Mm -hmm. um, so shall we maybe save him until we come to another one that we're, like, split on? Yeah, sure. Okay, um, we'll leave him for now. Yeah. Alincia. A. Ah, uh, yeah. I was... Yeah. I think I that's like fair. Him in a lot. I mean, I I was gonna say A or S to be honest. Mm. I really I I like she'd be probably a B for me in Path of Radiance, but in Radiant Dawn, I think she really comes into her own as a character. Yeah, I think she's interesting, and I think she has some interesting plot stuff. So, mm -hmm. Ina. Hmm. Hmm. She's kind of between a B and an A for me, to be honest. Yeah, for me, I'd say she's probably a B. I think she has some interesting stuff to do in Radiant Dawn, but I actually think her more interesting plotline for me is probably in Path of Radiance. Right. Um, I think B then. Yeah. Because she, I don't, I, I, I don't fair. like her as much as Kanegus and Alinsia yeah. for sure. Fiona. Oh, uh. She's not quite a question mark, question mark, question mark. <laughs> I can't, I'm not going to lie, it crossed my mind, but mm. I think she's probably more of a C, just for bland and new, entirely neutral. Yeah. I feel like any character that's a playable unit, we can't really put in question mark, question mark, question no. mark. She is probably the closest, though. Yeah. Well, actually, no, I think... Kaiser might be the close. No, no, actually, I'd still say Fiona. Kaiser has a personality. Mm. Just about. 
Gareth, he... <laughs> speaking of not really having a personality. Okay, so Gareth has to be in the C tier, yes. at least, just because it's very funny that he's called Gareth. and I. It is. I am fond of him an inordinate amount, considering he's there for all of, like, five seconds at the end of the game. Yeah, he is there to to deliver some exposition yeah. if you don't kill him. Yeah. Well, it's nice of him to do that, though. Yeah. Uh, Gatry. Um, I would so I'd say for me, Gatry's probably an A. I do oh, okay. I do think he's quite fun and um, he's a very useful unit, which helps a lot. See, he'd probably be a B for me. So oh, okay. Which out of Gatry and Edward do you feel most strongly about putting in the A tier? Probably Gatry. Okay, Gatry in A, Edward in B, in B, B. Mm. I don't know why I was saying like that. Jeffrey. <laughs> See, yeah, I think so. You do find out a bit about him. I just don't find him that interesting. No, he's just never that interesting. Like, um, yeah, I don't know. There's, there seems there's like a knight character in a lot of Fire Emblem games who is just kind of straightforward and a bit bland. And Jeffrey is very much that for me. We'll, we'll come to a couple in. In fact, I'd say there's a there's at least one in the. The other games as well. Oh, wow. There's... Well, we'll see. Yeah. Gift card. D. Oh, I would... Would you put him in C? I think he's a C. Okay, let's put him in C. Just because there's nothing objectionable yeah, about I'm being him. Yeah, just... that was me being mean. I think it's just because... Uh, no, I I will. I think I was thinking of Kaiser. Oh, okay. I, I was getting them mixed up, even though they look very different. Um, gift card is fine. So, I don't think we even need to have a discussion no. on this one. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, ooh, even ahead of Duke ooh. Oliver. I feel like everybody is going to be ahead of Duke Oliver. He just needs to be in the S tier as well. Oh, that reminds me. Um, Who are you looking for? No! <laughs> you can't. <laughs> just to get the like little chain of protective cuddles going. Yeah. Poor Ha. <laughs> yeah. What's going on? He didn't ask for this. No. Um, oh my god, now you've got, got to put them back. I've got to put them back now, yeah. Um, um that's that's right. Okay, cool. Heather. C. Yeah. Uh Hetzel. Um I think he's quite an interesting character. But mm. I also don't like him. <laughs> Yeah, I think he's interesting. Like, he, there's there's an interesting range of villains in this game, um, mm. which I quite like. Um, and I think Hetzel strikes an interesting chord of a kind of villain that you don't really see very much. Mm. Who is like, it's this, it's a sort of banality of evil sort of thing. Yeah. Which I think is, is which I quite like, and I think is an interesting thing to explore in a game like Fire Emblem. Mm. Um. So f for that alone, I think that would elevate him to a B for me, but I don't know how you feel about it. I would probably have said more of a kind of C, but I don't mind putting him in B just because I do think he's an interesting character. It's just one of those things where, like, I don't like him. Yeah, oh no, certainly not. I think that he's a character that's worth, like, exploring, so yeah. I'm happy to, like, go higher on that than I was planning. Yeah. Now our boy Ike... Okay, well, he's got to be, like, probably S-tier, right? I think he's got to be S-tier, yeah. I think I, Ike is I a really Ike. good protagonist. He is, I like him. Yeah, he like, he's a very good character, and he's he's rare among protagonists, and actually, to be perfectly honest, particularly Fire Emblem protagonists, in having a distinct and interesting character that goes beyond is the protagonist. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like how you can, like, root for him and it doesn't feel weird to be playing as him for... Yeah. I'm talking particularly Path of Radiance here. But it's not just a character that's made so that you p can put yourself in the character. He's yeah. his own kind of thing that he, works. He makes his own judgments about things that you might even disagree with at times, which I think is often a mark of a, a good protagonist character, actually. Mm. And, like, you might you know, occasionally is wrong or you might even think or you might think he's wrong. Mm. And doesn't always act in the optimal way. Mm. Nah, he's he's good. And I like how I just like the bit I really enjoyed the bit at the end of Radiant Dawn where he's like getting mad at Laren. Yeah. That was some good yeah. shit. 
Okay, Ilyana. C. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Izuka. Um. I got a lot of enjoyment out of Izuka in the early part of the game. See, I was going to say also a C, but for different reasons. Ah, okay. But I, I don't know if maybe he's a B because he has quite a lot of fun. Yeah. But I th that's where he's at, like, middlingly. Again, he's another flavor of uh, interesting antagonist, which is one who's just completely off the reservation. Mm. Uh, which is quite far off the rails, however, probably a better way to put that. Mm. Um, yeah, let's... What do you think? C, C or a B? I don't actually mind that much either way. I think C. Okay. I think Hetzel is more interesting. Yeah. Janaf. Um, B. Yeah. I think he's probably a high B. Yeah. I like him a lot. Um, and I am probably going to end up putting him in all key and different tiers. Mm, I, yes. <laughs> but I like, I like him and I like their dynamic. Jill. Now, if this was purely off Jill in Path of Radiance, I would be going s mm. but she's kind of between a and s for me just because she doesn't get that much to do in radiant dawn yeah she doesn't get as much certainly but, but um, she's still one of my faves so i still kind of am rooting for s yeah i think i i, I would be perfectly happy to okay. put her in s let's call i was her kind s, of thinking then. that already no put it put him one to the left please yeah <laughs> 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 now, might we have two S's in a row? Yes, we do. I think we, we do. probably we do. do. We do. <laughs> no discussion necessary a on legend. that one. Uh, and he will definitely be in a, in a higher tier than Oscar. I'm going to oh, say it now. So He's got to be. Like, he's the better, he's the superior paladin. Mm. Chris Naga. Um, hmm. I would say, for me... Much like his sister, he is somewhere between B and A for me. Yeah. I think he does have a really interesting role in Radiant Dawn. Um, um, oh god, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, maybe an A? But then, no, I like Almeida about as much as him. Yeah, so probably I would he's, say he's, He should probably be a B with her. With the rest of his family, that's nice. Aw, aw. Well, it might not be quite... <laughs> It might not be quite the rest of his family. Well, mm. so who's this next one? Oh, La it's Largo. Largo, yeah. Uh, D. Yeah. Uh, Laura. Uh, she was. This is a bit of a weird thing. There were a couple of characters introduced at the very beginning of the game where I was like, "Oh, they seem kind of like nice and interesting," and then nothing happens. Yeah. And for that reason, C. Yeah, I think so. That's fair. Leanne. Our first oh, Leanne's probably an A for me. Yeah, I think that's fair. I, I like, like her a lot. a lot. I would say, and not to um, preface where we go to with the, the other herons too much, but I think she is my favourite of the three of them. Oh, okay. Um, we we will get to that. I think we will differ on Raison. <laughs> I think we might be throwing hands. No, we won't. <laughs> you wouldn't songs, want us to. Songs only. <laughs> um, Lacan. Uh, probably a C again. Oh, okay. Oh no, maybe a B actually. I'd say he he's a B. More, he's kind of more conniving, kind of. Yeah, I I think again he's a really enjoyably hateful villain. Mm. He's very very slimy. Mm. Not as slimy as uh, S for slime Duke Oliver though. Well, no, but he's a different kind of slime, a different he, flavor. He's kind of slimed himself. Yes. He's used his oil of slipperiness. Mm, oof, he sure has. Uh, Leonardo. C. C, probably. Yeah. Leith. Now, okay. Mm. So, I love Leith a lot, but she has naff all to do in Radiant Dawn. Yeah. And so I think I'm... I would probably say B. I think I'd probably go B as well. But yeah. honestly, if it was based on her role in Path of Radiance, she'd be pushing like S tier for me. But mm. I think B overall. Yeah. And Lucia. Um, you know, I didn't think much of her after the first game, but maybe a B. I think she's a B for me. I think. I think she's kind of cool. She does. She definitely steps up in um, in Radiant Dawn. Yeah. For all that, actually, you don't see a huge amount of her. I think 
you get a lot more of a sense of what makes her tick. It feels like she and Bastion should really be in the same tier as well, I think. Not yeah. just because they're, like, associates, but because... Oh, I think they get married if you put them as an A support, actually. Uh, I don't want that, though. Hmm. <laughs> I don't think that's a good match for either of them. Now, I have actually forgotten this lad's name, but he is the antagonist of part two. Oh, he's the, like... He's the, like, the... rebel Crimea... Ludvek, that's his name. Yeah. Okay. Um, probably a D. Really? Or a C. I'm... He's probably the least interesting of the antagonists. I think so. And actually, uh, it's a shame that Jared, the antagonist of part one, isn't here. Oh, is, I... is he not on the list? No, he's not. For some weird reason, he's not. He's, like, the only one of the sort of major named antagonists who isn't. Oh, uh, wow. Gi given that there's a character on this list who doesn't even appear in the game. Yeah, who's that? <laughs> it's Rajayon. Oh, yeah. Um... Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah, I, th I think he's probably a C. Yeah. I think oh, he... I'm sad that Jared isn't, because he'd maybe be a B villain. Yeah, oh, for sure, he's yeah. He's kind of interesting. I think he's cool. And uh, Liar. Uh, she's just kind of... I wish that some of what her, she did was given to Leith, because then Leith would have more stuff to do. Mm-hmm, yeah. And for that reason, a D. <laughs> Harsh but fair. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't even have a red gem. <laughs> Useless. If he did, he wouldn't know what to do with it. Well, he clearly doesn't in yeah. uh, Path of Radiance, where he's up to his eyeballs in debt. Yeah. Um, Marcia? Um, Above Makalov, anyway. Well, yeah, I think probably a C. I think a C, yeah. I do quite like her, but, like, I've never had a particular fondness for her. I think the kind. trouble is that a lot of her plot ends up, her, like... Plot stuff ends up being about Maklov, mm. who is despicable and I don't mm. care for. Yeah. So her and Astrid have a shared problem in that regard. Yeah. Uh, at least we're keeping them separate. Mm. Meg. So, here's my sadness about Meg. I think her design is very cute. Mm. But she doesn't get to do anything interesting and she is shit. She is... Arguably the worst. So let's put her in D because I, think she, I feel unfortunately, like. Unfortunately, I think she's a D. Putting her any higher would be reckless generosity. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we've got a. I would say a, oh. a whole <sighs> line of good ones here. Strong run coming up. Okay, so Mia first off. Okay, so she's got to be like A tier at least. She's right? at least an A for sure. I I would hear an argument for her being S. Um, but she's definitely at least an A. I think A. I think she's she's maybe towards the high end of the A. Tier. I would say so as well. But um, um, like as a as a unit, she might be S tier as a character. <laughs> um, she certainly sort of was a. in our playthrough. Well, yeah, and I think most playthroughs I've yeah. ever done, to be honest. Micaiah then. For me, I'd say Micaiah's pretty firmly A tier. I yeah. think that's fair. I like her a lot. I yeah. do really like her. I think what's holding her back from being S tier is that after a certain point in the story, when, like, Yuna comes in, we don't actually hear that much from her, and so yeah. she kind of gets, like, cut out of the climax. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think if she had more of, like, a contribution after that point, she'd probably be higher. Yeah. Yeah, it, it is kind of a shame, but I think she is a... An interesting character and a, a fun character. Mm. Um, Mist. Again, like with Mia, either A or S, I think. I'd say A. I'd say, again, I'd say she's pretty solidly A for me. I do like Mist a lot. And if anything, maybe even more in, in Radiant Dawn. I th There's a kind of subtle but well done sort of maturing of her character between yeah. games, I think. And she turned out so much more interesting than what I expected yeah. from, like, the opening of Path of Radiance, where I was like, oh, boring, protect the protagonist sister. Yeah. Boring, boring. <gasps> a. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, even though he doesn't get a huge amount to do in in Radiant Dawn, he's still just such a lovable character. That is why he's held back from S, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Because he didn't have as much, he didn't get much, as much to do in the second game. Speaking of getting nothing to do in the second oh, game, more him. Uh, C. Yeah, unfortunately, I do like him, um, but yeah, he he gets basically nothing to do. Yeah. In. The very few bits he does get are 
are subservient to Tormod, who himself doesn't really get much to do. Mm. Naisala. Uh, A. I think he's he's an A for me as well, yeah. He actually went up in my estimations when I realised that he had a, a beaky nose. In oh, the yeah, arc, yeah. Which doesn't come across that well in his portrait. But uh, I like his weird nose. Mm, it's mm. good. It's good. It's a good. It's a good vibe. And uh, Nyla. Uh. I don't know. I feel so. I feel like the C tier is mostly full of people who are fairly bland, and I don't think she's that. But I also never particularly warmed to her. I th- I think she'd probably be a C for me to okay. be honest. Like. Yeah. I mean, you're right that C is mostly people who are bland, but also Izuka is there. Oh, yeah, that's so. true. <laughs> He's bringing that spice. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Put her I, like, she'd be a relatively high C, but I still... I never feel like I have much of a sense of what makes her tick, especially in relation to the other Lagoos Royals. Yeah. Well, what makes her tick is uh, Raphael's sexy heron sexiness <laughs> or something. She yeah. does talk about, like, how she likes... His heroniness. Oh, yeah. Okay. Nasir. Uh, I like Nasir. He has nothing to do, really. No. Well, he doesn't have that much to do in Radiant Dawn. Yeah, he has a lot to do in Path of Radiance, which helps. But um, I like him. Mm. I don't know whether he should... I think maybe he should be a B. Yeah, I think he's a... He, again, he's probably a low B. But yeah. like, I think he, he earns that. Nialuchi. <laughs> a B. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like Neil Lucci. He is oddly entertaining. He's just a laugh, and I support him. Um, oh my god, I've completely forgotten her Nephany. name. Nephany. Yeah, thank you, God. Um, I feel like she should be in B. Yeah, I think so. I can remember Largo's name and Amy's name, but I can't remember <laughs> Nephany's name. I feel like she should be in the same tier as Brom, because I like them both about the yeah. same for different reasons. I think that's fair, yeah. I do kind of wish that Nephany had more to do, because she has a really interesting design. Mm. And I know that you said she can be useful, but yeah. Yeah, unfortunately she just hasn't really turned out that way in our playthroughs of either Path of Radiance or Radiant Dawn. Speaking of people who didn't turn out as great as they might, Nolan. I do feel like I invest Nolan with slightly more personality than he actually has, unfortunately. I feel like that is true, but also I do see him as Sean Bean now, and yeah. that makes me like him a lot more than I otherwise would have done. Although he did survive the game. Yeah, yeah, that's surprising, actually. I would maybe think of him being a high C. I'd say he's high C, low B. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, I, mm, Do you, are you thinking of bumping I'd him I'd lean up? more towards a B for let's him. Bump him up. Let's bump yeah. him up. Let's put him, like, uh, why not? I'd say I like him at a sim- similar level to Edward. Uh, okay. Actually, may- maybe, may- not quite as much as Edward. But. You know, I actually like them about the same, so I should really have been putting for Nolan in B anyway, just because... Yeah, that's yeah. fair enough. New, <laughs> new Mida. New Mida? New Mida. Uh, this lad. I don't really... I... I'm not total. Nothing really sets this lad apart from the other senators. The yeah. other, the others all have distinct personalities. He doesn't really. He's there for them to talk to. Yeah, he's got a bucket hat. So D. D. Yeah, there's not much to him. Oscar below Kieran anyway. Uh, B. Yeah, I think that's fair. Peleus. I think this could be an interesting one. Hmm. Oh, this is kind of tricky, actually. Because... Mm. He's a much more interesting character than he first appears. Yeah, I think also, I, if I was experiencing the game for the second time, I might feel differently about him. But because they kind of have to keep some stuff under wraps, I don't really know. But maybe like a B? I'd say he's probably a B for he's, me. He's, he's pretty interesting. Yeah, I, and I think especially... On a second playthrough, if you have the option to keep him alive, he, he develops more interesting facets as well. Mm. Rajayan literally has no lines in the entire in either of the two games. Yeah, so but it, he's beautiful though. I think he might have to be a question mark. Question yeah. mark. Question mark. Raphael. Um. So he's like my least favorite heroine. Would it be fair to say 
C. Yeah, I think behind. So. Oh my god, where he, he should has, be exactly. He needs to be there. Ranulf. A. Yeah, I think A is exactly right for Ranulf. Uh, I do like him a lot. Uh, and he gets a lot to do. He get, gets a fair amount in Ray, uh, Path of Radiance, but he gets a lot in Radiant Dawn. Yeah, I, I like, like Ranulf. Renning. Um, C. Yeah, I think so. Just he, does not get a huge amount yeah. to do. Now. Oh my god, this is when we're going to fight, isn't it? So <laughs> I think I should probably go first. Okay, you go first, and then I'll be, and then I'll mount a defense. Race on hovers somewhere between an A and a B for me. I would say. Um, I like him, but um, and he does get actually get a lot to do in both games. In fact, um, which is good. Um, but like, there's nothing about him that I think is particularly well. His role in the plot is interesting. I don't find him that engaging, I think. He's very pretty, though. Well, yeah, but so are a lot of these people. So are the herons. Just herons being pretty. So is Duke Oliver. Oh, Duke Oliver is... <laughs> his own thing. Hmm. So actually, I this we are not as different on this as I thought we were going to be, because hmm. I assumed you were going lower down and we're going to be like, Raison's shit, actually. <laughs> Because I would probably want him to be at least an A, but not necessarily higher than an A. I'd say A is right for him, I yeah. like him a lot, and he's probably on the high end of A for me, but he, I don't like him as much as, mm. like, Jill, for example. I mean, I would say I don't like him quite as, as much as Leanne, for instance, although I don't think there isn't much in it for me. See, I prefer him to Leanne, but there's not that much in it either. Right. <laughs> so I guess we're just kind of, like, the opposite way around. So, Reese. So, okay, so... <laughs> There's going to be some slight bias inherent here, I think. So I do love him, but also, does he really do anything? No. Nothing at all. So I think he has to be a C. I think so. But I felt like me and Reese had a connection. Like, mm. as in, my voice for him was perfect. Mm. And then he was just not at all in either of the games, really. I mean, speaking of perfect voices. Okay, D. <laughs> oh, I think that's harsh. Do you? Yeah, I I don't mind Rolf. Um, I I I would say I like him better again in in Radiant Dawn than I do in Path of Radiance. Okay. Um, well, let's put him in C then because he has green hair and is therefore like relatable to me. Sonaki. Ooh. So definitely a B. Yeah, I'd say so. But a high B. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm always surprised when I replay the game how much I end up liking her. I think she's interesting. She's another one with Mist where she, like the the maturing across mm, the games yeah. has done very well. Um, and Alincia for that matter in yes, terms yes. of like rulers. But I like I I I, I think yeah for her particularly because she's going from being like a kind of like quite bratty child to like. A teenager who's learning some of the responsibilities of leadership. I think it's done very well. Yeah. So Sephiroth slash Lara. <laughs> oh, I see. I see. He's in the Sephiroth. He is placing. under Sephiroth. Yeah. yeah. Um. Probably a B. Yeah, I'd say. I think I could possibly mount an argument for him being an A because I think he is. A, a really interesting character, but mm. that really only gets revealed at not even the eleventh hour, eleven fifty-eight. <laughs> yeah. Um, and it does it sheds a lot of interesting light on a lot of stuff that happens in the previous two games. Mm. Um, but I don't know that there's enough there to kind of justify him being in the upper echelons. Yeah, let's go for the high the high B. I call him a high B. Yeah, she not. Um, C. As a as a unit, A or S. As a person, D. So <laughs> yeah. I think C is probably a fair compromise. That's exactly my maths on it. Sigrun. Um. Probably also a C. Yeah. I I'd, like Sigrun. For me, I'd say she teases somewhere between C and B. Uh, she just doesn't have, like, that much interesting plot stuff for me to really, like, yeah. gauge her level above that. I think for me, Scrimeer is an S. 
Okay, I was going to say A, but he's very funny. He is. That's what tips it He's me. given me a lot of... I've had a lot of laughs. Yeah. Shed a lot of tears from laughing so much. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. You know I what? Think, I think let's I'm very him, happy to put him Let's put him, him up there. there. I love him. Ooh, might we have two S's in a row? Soren is an S tier for me, absolutely. Yeah, I, I'm very happy with that. Um... But we're getting onto this. This is quite a high run again, I think. Maybe. Mm, yeah, I've. For me, Sotha teeters somewhere between B and A. I would say. I was gonna say an A for Sotha actually, but okay. um, I don't mind. I I don't like him as much as some of the people in the A tier. So. See, that's the problem. When I look at the people who are in A, I don't like him as much as I would say really any of them. Right. Um. Well, maybe like he's probably not too far off someone like um, like Rayson or Gatry. Mm. Uh, in fact, to be honest, if Gatry's there, I think so. They probably should okay, be as well. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's let's chuck Sotha in there. And definitely a lot higher than I would have expected to put him after put yeah. Path of Radiance. Put it that way. He would have been so low down for me on that one. Anyway, I have a real fondness for Stefan, but like he's cool and he's interesting. Yeah. Um. I think probably a B. I'd say a B, yeah. Well, but a well-earned B. Yeah, you know? for a for very little screen time and very few lines, I think he makes a real impression. Mm. In both games, actually. Yeah, I think considering that a lot of what he does is kind of reveal stuff about other people, he is still quite... And honestly, just the humour factor of him emerging from the one spot in the desert. I mean, yeah, he does have one of my favourite boss <laughs> lines in the... in. In the game, uh, where he's, you know, he says something cool like "I am the desert and I brook no intrusion," and the the other lad, Buckethead, in fact, mm. is like, "Who? Where did you come from?" Ah, uh. <laughs> which is fun. Um, Ta I'd say Tanith is a B for me. I don't know. That's how... exactly where I was gonna say. I definitely like her more than Sabra. Yeah, I think she's she's more interesting, and she also has the girls in. Um, oh yeah. The Radiance, but yeah, I like Tanith. She's cool. Um, Toronio. Toronio is a C for me. I'd say probably similar. I kind of I want to like him more for some reason, mm. but like yeah, mm. um. This is for all the surprising amount of screen time he gets in Radiant Dawn. There's just not that much to him, really. I mean, I don't think I need to ask, do I? S. Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm glad that we agree. <laughs> yeah, I mean, in the same way as it was for her, I, I was going to just drag Tabarn straight up to mm. S. I'm glad that you knew that I would be okay with it as well. Yeah. Um... Scanning the rest, I think he might be our last S, actually. Uh, although, there might be an argument to be made for one or two of them. Titania. I feel like if Gatry is an A, then Titania should probably also be an A. Yeah, I think that's fair. She's she's cool. Yeah, I do like her a lot. Again, I think she gets less to do in Radiant Dawn. And we kind of... There's less of her as a character in Radiant Dawn than in Path of Radiance. She's definitely riding high on my residual fondness for her from Path of Radiance. Yeah. But I think she is in the game enough and, like, yeah, the Grail Mercenaries are in it enough as a group that she can rank high enough. Rank yeah. High. I'm assuming Tormat's going to be a C. Oh, right. I was actually going to say D, but you know what? Let's give the lad a chance and put him in C. Yeah, he is slightly irritating, but slightly irritating in a sort of his heart's in the right place yeah. way. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so. Mm. <laughs> at least an A. For yeah, oh, for sure. Yeah. Like, my question was going to be is he an A or an S? And I think for me, he's probably more an A. Mmm. Uh, I think the thing is, like, it's partly what we have, like, built around his yes. character, which doesn't necessarily mean he shouldn't be high, but I think A is probably fairer. Yeah, I mean, I have always liked Ulki a lot, and I've always, uh, as much as I do like Janoff as well, I've always preferred Ulki. Mm. So, yeah. Uh, oh god, what's his name? Valtome. Um, C. Mm -hmm. Ponyo's dad there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, he's 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 enjoyably slimy, but not 
in a way that doesn't quite have the depth of like Lacan. Or Duke Oliver. Well, nothing has the the girth of Duke Oliver. Uh, Vika. Um. See. See. Yeah. She's almost a question mark, question mark, but not quite. She's close to it, isn't she? Yeah. Volk. Oh, maybe a B. From I think Volk. for me, he's a B I for like, sure. Yeah. I like. Again, very little screen time. Uh, although he gets a fair bit in Path of Radiance, actually. Um, but. He makes an impression. It's just cool when he does show up. Yeah. And, like, the way he shows up. I don't know. Valuk. Now, Valuk is Schningle's favourite character. Because he's a doggo. Um, so we can put him below a B for sure. <laughs> <laughs> we could just make an extra tier for all of them that's Schningle's favourite. But mm -hmm. that seems a bit... Schningle will know that he has that tier anyway. Yeah. Um, maybe a... I think it'd be... B, yeah. I don't think I can justify him putting any higher. I'm yeah. sorry, Shmi. <laughs> now, Zyhark is where I think we need to wrestle with a bit more of what's going on with him slash the Black Knight. Ah, you mean Zelgius. Z sorry, Zelgius, yeah. <laughs> Z Unless there's the ultimate final, <laughs> ultimate twist. Yeah, there's a whole other game in which Zyhark turns out yeah. to be the Black Knight. Uh, yeah, so Zelgius. I think, I don't know, because, like, I might want him to be an A, just for the fact that it's, he has a very interesting story, mm. and I think the twist is very well done. Yes. And I didn't get, it was very satisfying, I didn't guess that it was him, mm. but also, I wasn't, like, it didn't feel like, oh, what? How could that be? It yeah. felt correct. So I think A for, like, twist execution Oof. and interesting backstory. I think, yeah, it is a very good twist because as soon as you hear it, you're like, oh, and, like, it starts clicking that I, that actually makes a lot of sense from everything I, you've seen of him. And I think that if I played the games again, both the games, I'd get a lot more, even more. I, I think that's the case, yeah. Um, finally, Zyhark. Uh, probably a B. I'd say he's a he B. He's a drow legend. I, I like him, but like, that's I wouldn't go much further than that. Okay, so should we? Is there like the thing where we can see what the community have ranked? Oh yeah. Oh, oh, what's going on? Oh God. Okay, so this is the. Okay. Wow. Well, you're we're. We're in, in touch with uh, the community. Often, what the hell is Nyla doing there? Nephany. Yeah. I Nef guess maybe if she was more useful to some people, they the, might. I think it's as a unit, yeah. Mm. And li like, um, I mean, most of the, the the ones that we aren't, that we we didn't put in there are people we considered putting in there. Yeah. Uh, uh, are there any other, like, kind of outliers? Um, not really. Not hugely, I don't what think. What is Duke Oliver doing in the C tier? I mean, that's clearly absurd. Who's in D? Okay, yeah. Yeah. No, I think that it's also fair because it's like... It's mostly villains, actually. I can see why you would put in like just people you don't like in there as well. Yeah. Um. Okay. Wow. That's fair. That's actually, that's not as different from ours as I thought it might be, actually. No, it's pretty close, actually. Um, so shall we move on to Awakening? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm ready. I probably know, I can probably remember. So for context, I played Awakening, like, at the end of last year. Mm. And Fates straight afterwards. And you haven't, when did you last play? I have been like part way through a playthrough um for a while now uh which is the first time i've played it in a few years but i have played it like several times okay in the couple of years after it okay. first came out so i can probably remember who more or less everyone is okay so they are in no particular order which is interesting uh they're also weird height order going yeah. on <laughs> yeah i wish Don't they really were know why. on their faces uh i i think i can tell who everyone is okay though. Okay, so Sumia first. Um. B. 
Okay. I'd say she's a B or an A for me. I so like her. And you know what? Let's put her in an A. Yeah. Because she is actually kind of an interesting character. I think she is. She's more so than she first appears. I mean, look, this is going to come up a lot uh, for Awakening and especially Fates. But I think they both suffer from the thing of... Uh, for all their like relatively detailed support conversations, I think they they suffer from characters having like a single trait that defines them. Mm. Um, but I think I think there is a little more to Sumia, which mm. is helpful. Kellen. Uh, B. Yeah, I'd say so. I like Kellen. He is very. I do find him very funny. Yeah, yeah. Um. um Donald. Donald. Yeah. Probably an A. He's quite fun as well, actually. That might that is swayed by the fact that he was very useful in my playthrough. Yeah, he I every playthrough I've ever done, he's either been amazing or terrible, depending on how much I use him, uh. basically. Um but yeah, I can see I can see I can see a uh, good argument for him being an A. Lonku. Oh, I like Lonku. Me too, actually, yeah. Um um, he's still probably not quite in it, quite the like very top leagues, but no, I'd say he's an A for me. Yeah, I think I think A is fair. <laughs> so, I think we're being surprisingly generous so far, actually. I mean, that's but that's cause... about to come crashing to an end. I think is that Rickon? That's Rickon. Yeah. Okay, D. Yeah. I don't like him. Yeah, well, he's just know. a bit shit. Yeah, basically. Uh, Maribel. Uh. Maribel, I. I... Just butchered her name, Maribel. Probably a D as well. She, I would say she's slightly better than than Rickon. Also, but... I got them married in my playthrough, so I like to. I oh, think about, that's I nice. think they should maybe be together, and they're introduced yeah. at the same time. Uh, so actually, I'm doing them a favor by putting them both. In the hmm. Uh, Pan. I like her A. Okay. I like Pan a lot. I think she would have been more of a B for me, but um, I can see her as an A. I'm happy with that. Um, Gaius. Uh, I don't care for Gaius. I'd say he's maybe a C. Yeah. Me. He's inexplicably popular. Uh, I don't quite understand. I think my taste in Awakening characters differs quite a bit from a lot It'll of people. It'll be people's. interesting to see the community rank then. Yeah. Uh, Cordelia. Uh, B? I'd say she's a B for me as I well. I quite like her. Me too. Not as much as Sumia, which yeah. is why it makes sense. I would. Know. Yeah, I would say the same. Yeah. Handsome okay, Gregor. Han Handsome Gregor, my love has to be S tier for me. Fair enough. I did, like, S for spouse tier. Me and Gregor were an item. <laughs> He's very funny as well. <laughs> he is, I do like him a lot. Now, here comes my, uh, my own popular opinion, I think, because I really don't like Krom. Okay. I, like, I think he's one of the few on this list that I would... I wouldn't quite put him at any E, but I really... Ooh. I I, <laughs> I would say I come closer to disliking him than just n kind of not being fond of him. I'm quite neutral on him. I'm I, surprised to hear this. I find him really irritating. I am glad I didn't end up with my character, like, accidentally married yeah, to him. Yeah, like a lot of people do. Um, Maybe a C? What would... I, he'd be a D for me. Oh, should we wait until we have another disagreement? Okay, then... sure, sure. Okay, so the next one, E. Okay, uh, I can understand that. I think that's yeah. Thank I you. I don't think she's as bad as you think she is, but like I can understand why. You I think tell you that what, way. you can put Crom in the one that you like that you don't like then, because I've <laughs> I've voted no Noe. Noe, yeah. I voted her down. Um. Libra. Libra, thank you. Ah, uh, he's fine. C B. Uh, I think it's probably more of a C. For probably me. more of a C. He is kind of like he doesn't have as much of a sort of personality as. The people higher up. Yeah. And a lot of his thing is just mistaken for girl. Yeah. I like Tharja a lot. Okay, Tharja maybe an S tier? I think... She, I mean, I think each of us get an S for spouse. Okay, so, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think that's fair. Okay, Anna. Yeah. Uh, Anna. Anna with a personality. Yeah. Anna with support conversations. Uh, S some support conversations. B? Yeah, maybe a B. She's quite useful, actually. I like the, the, the Annas, the lore. Yeah. Um, that is quite fun. Uh, Olivia. Uh, uh, maybe a B. 
or a C? It's probably slightly more of a C than a B for me. Let's go for a C then. Yeah. Um. Share, share, share. Oh yeah, share. Yeah. However you pronounce her name. Um, C. Yeah. I I I find her quite useful, but her personality is basically Wyvern is cute. I mean, to, which to be, is true. She is not. She is she's not, not wrong. wrong. <laughs> yeah. Um. Okay. This this lad. Yeah. I don't like him. Uh yeah. It's. Mm, I think a lot of people seem to find him a lot funnier and more charming than I do. Henry. That's what he's Henry, called. Henry. Yeah. Uh, for me, he's probably C ish. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go for a C. I don't care for him. I like. I like some of the people in C better than him. Yeah. But you know. I wouldn't say he's quite a D tier. Um, um, Sayri. Um, I think she's a nailed on C for me. I'm yeah. completely neutral to her. Yeah. I never really used her. And similarly, I can't remember the name of the of her, the next one. Oh, Tiki? But I think she's probably a C as well. Yeah, see, the pro part of the problem is um, she is kind of a walking reference to previous games. Oh, okay. Because she is actually from... Um, one of the the earliest games. Mm. The thing is, in Japan, that was um, remade. That game had just come out as a, a remake of that game had just come out. Okay. Um, but it never actually came out here, although there is a fan translation, which is worth playing, actually. It's a good game. Okay. But um, I think because of that, certainly when I first played Awakening, I was just a bit baffled by her. Yeah. I like her more because I have played that game, but... Okay. Yeah. Anyway, Basilio. Yeah. Um, I like Basilio. I'd say maybe he's a B for Basilio for me. Yeah, I think I think that's fair. I wanted him and Flavia to be recruitable early on, mm. and they weren't, and I was sad. Yeah, they are later on, though. I know, but I wanted them straight away. Come and join me, squad. Now. Our child? <laughs> no. Oh, wait, no. Our child is later on. This is us. Wait, is it? Yep. There's but that looks nothing like me. D2. <laughs> <laughs> I think I I feel like I can't justify putting Robin any any higher or lower than a C. Okay. Just because like <laughs> Robin is very much the kind of bland protagonist. When sort I of thing. played Robethin, mm -hmm. she was very cool though. Like because you know she was incredibly cool. <laughs> okay, Flavia. Flavia, probably a B as well. Yeah, I like her and Basilio about the same amount. Yeah, I like their dynamic. Right, Lucina. I think Lucina might be an A for me. Yeah, she's I like cool. her a lot. Um, I think she's like... She's, she's better than Grom. <laughs> she's way better than Grom. She has a personality. Uh, she's an interesting character. Um, as opposed to... Grom running headfirst into every situation he ever sees. And then being like, Oh, thank goodness I have you to pull me out. My strategist friend. Yeah, joke's on him though, because I'm shit at that. <laughs> mm. Okay, S tier, yes. please. I mean, I there was no him. way he was ever not going to be S tier. Yeah. I love Owen so much. Um, okay, what is his Inigo. name in this game? Inigo. Yeah, which I remember purely because there are some Princess Bride references in his um, like introductory chapter. Okay, um, probably like E or D. I don't yeah, like him. I'd call I'd call him a D. I don't really like him okay. either. Um I was, again, he's weirdly popular and I don't at all understand why. Now, <laughs> Kanji. Sorry, Brady. Brady. <laughs> I like Brady. <laughs> Brady, I like Brady a lot. <laughs> he's probably at least a B. He's a le he might I think I'd, I Can we put him in an A? I I think I might. I just it like how is how I also find it very funny how they're like, oh, he's such an ugo when he like. <laughs> <laughs> he's just a normal looking person with a scar. Yeah. I also just like the fact that um, he. I was like, I think when I got him, when I recruited him, I remember messaging you being like, why do Maribel and Rickon have an Irish son now? Just because his name was Brady. Mm. Like I don't. Um, I can't remember what his voice was like. Can is he played by the actor? That no, no, he just looks like a bit like okay. Angie. But um, I I was pleased by his presence. He was not what I expected from Maribel's kid at all. Yeah, no, I think he is fun. Uh, Kiel, Kiel, Kiel. Mm. See. Yeah, I'm pretty neutral to her. She's fine. I really, really, 
<laughs> hey. Yeah, easily. I re- I love Cynthia. She's so cute. Like she would be. I. She would be close to an S tier. Yeah, me, I, I don't like her quite as much as Owain. No, but I like but. The, I like them in similar ways. Yeah, actually, you know degree. what? Can we bump her up to I an S tier? I think she's very cute. I would be very happy to have her as an S tier. Um, and I like her better than Lucina, which is kind of unfair because Lucina's very like solemn and so obviously. Yeah. But yeah. I I I really like them as siblings actually. Mm. Is that Pan's kid? No. No, that's... Um, Cordelia's kid, uh, Severa. The one who's like, I'm a tsundere, and that's yeah. my whole thing. Yep. Yeah. Um, B, C... I think she's probably a C for me. Okay. She's fine. I mean, I can't really remember that much about her, so... Yeah. Um. Oh, that's Jerome. Thingy. Jerome, he's uh, Shersh's uh, kid. Uh, C... I'd, I'd maybe bump him down to a D. I don't really like him. Okay. I mean, I don't really feel that strong. I like Shersh better than him, to be yeah. fair. Yeah. Now, our our beautiful children. Oh, oh my God. It's my son. And uh, my it's daughter. S. It's my son. <laughs> I, lo- I love my son. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my son. I actually do like Morgan a lot. Me too. Um, <laughs> I, li- I like, I mean, having played through the game multiple times as both a male and a female main character, I like them both a lot. I do have a preference for the the female one, but that's partly just because I feel like she is my beautiful daughter. Oh, I've only played and had my like my son, and I liked my son a lot. I thought he was good, and I was proud of him, and I wanted him to grow up. To be- and I got him married to Cynthia, actually. Oh yeah, no, so that's it's a good nice choice. It there. Um, okay, it's. Oh yeah, I've t- also totally forgotten her name, um, which is a shame because I actually quite like her. Uh... Is it something with an L? Yes. Should I just look it up? Please. I don't want to like disgrace her by not knowing her name. Yeah, it's, it's a shame because I actually do quite like her. Yeah. And, and yet for some reason I've been able to remember the names of like every other character. Yeah, you can remember uh, Jerome. I even married her in my most recent playthrough. Oh my god, this is shocking scene. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Characters. Oh god, oh, there's not just a list of characters. Um, It should be early on. Uh, no, it's not. Ah. Okay, don't worry. I will find it. Let's move on to... Oh, 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 no. It was up there. It was up there. Where? Uh, plus. Um, oh, no. That's it. Am- Amaran. Okay, you know what? Let's move on to the next character. Sure. And I will find out the I name. mean, we could also just already... <laughs> rank her. Put her at a B. I just feel bad. Because I quite like her. Yeah, I mean, B is probably where she should go yeah. yeah okay okay so mystery lady called like L- lissa lissa okay good yes okay this i knew lad. it was something like the name of the country uh yarn uh yarn. <laughs> yeah that's his name how did i forget that that's weird <laughs> um d yeah i don't like him that much nor do i and i like pan a lot and i i had her marry longku and i like them both a lot so i was very disappointed by their offspring yeah um laurent Oh, it's weird that we're sorting him before his mother. Yeah. Uh, D. Mm, yeah. He's just like a knockoff version of his parent. Yeah, the, which is annoying. I don't like it when they, they just have very similar personalities. And Noir. Oh, she's cute. I like Noir I think a lot. A. She, yeah, I mean, slightly biased by the fact that she is also my beautiful daughter. Oh, yeah, you have like multiple in this game. Mm. Okay. Um, oh, I don't know who that is because I didn't have no oh, marry anyone. She's better. Okay, well then you can put her wherever you want because I don't uh, get put her to her an opinion. Seat. I I don't have a huge amount of opinion on her, but she is less horrible than Noe. Uh, Frederick. A boring knight character. My, my French son, Frederick. I'd forgotten he he I'd forgotten about him. He is the boring knight character of this yeah. one. Yeah. Uh, Sully. Sully, yeah, I quite like Sully. Yeah, I think she's chill. I think maybe she's a B for me. Yeah, me too. Um, Virion is quite fun, actually. I thought he was going to be awful when I mm. first met him, but then actually he's hilarious, and mm. I think he should probably be in the A tier. Oh. Uh, like, at least B. Yeah. He's borderline. He's cl- more closer to a B for me, I okay, would say. Okay, let's put him in the B then. I would. Just... I definitely don't like him as much as... Actually, no. You know what? If if Donald's in A, then I think Virion does belongs there as well. Okay. Because I probably like him better than Donald. Um, I can't style. remember. I couldn't remember who he was. I... 
I don't think I've ever used style past like chapter five. I think I used him as breeding stock. Oh, I think I've used I've used him as that. All right. Yeah. <laughs> um. um. See. Let's see. Yeah. I like Frederick better than him, but they I, are basically I do as like, well, very yeah. similar. Uh, this, Vic. Um. I don't think I really used him very. He's much. okay. Uh, He's probably a C as well. Yeah, I'm not normally a, a big fan of the like warrior mm, archetype in uh, Fire Emblem games in terms of their usefulness. And finally, Muriel. Uh, oh. A B or an A? I'd put her at a B, I think. I like her. I quite like her. I considered marrying her marrying her on my first playthrough. But then Thaja was there. and you're But like, then, yeah. Holy shit. Mm, mm, she just loomed out at me. Very much like when we first met. <laughs> she just met. stalked you yeah. for like, a long enough time. Uh, okay. okay. Let's see how we compare. Uh, okay. Why is Handsome Gregor not in the S tier? Owen is, at least. Um, what's Maribel doing there? Oh, yeah. Well, I suppose the thing is we don't know how many people have done this. Uh, so... 20. Okay. Oh, wow. That is quite a lot, actually. Uh, it was like 100 and something for the Rated yeah. Dog. Yeah. I mean, like, it's it's not just one person loves Maribel that's got her up there. I'll... I'll... I'll give the E tier some credit, although I, I, I'm a bit more fond of Na and Kiel at least. Um, I I'm just shocked and appalled by the low placement of Handsome Gregor. I mean, I That's... also I, I'm not a uh, a fan of the fact that they have put my beautiful and perfect daughter next to an ego. Keep keep her away from him, uh... please. Actually, a lot of people ship them, which I don't like either. Oh, what? Keep them away. Keep. Is he one of the children? Yes, His he child is. is in he is Olivia's kid. He's... Oh, yeah. I don't like him. No, I don't either. Okay. It's right. Time for, Let's it's take time the plunge. For the, for the ordeal. Okay. Uh, oh, why are we on... Oh, it looks like they might not have all of the characters. They've got a lot. Okay. Including, like, some NPCs at the bottom. Oh, why is Jacob on there twice? Uh, is he? Yeah. Don't worry. I you'll, can't even see him once, but we'll get, get there. Well, my, like, laser-targeted Lorenz Helm and Gloss division. Oh, yeah. I assume it, it was only a trifle for location. <sighs> it was only a trifle. Okay, um, so let's start. Oh, this is alphabetical as well, I think. Is it? Oh, it might be, actually. Okay, anyway. Arthur. Yes. He's a laugh. I he think is. A for Arthur. Fair enough. Because yeah. he's a laugh. Um, Asugi. Asugi, yes, not Gaius. Um, D, D, because he's just a discount version yeah. of a character from Awakening. Now, the two versions of the protagonist. Oh, they don't look like me. <laughs> Destroy them. <laughs> um, I don't know. I actually, I actually like the protagonist. Should we add an E tier? I feel like there should yeah. be an E tier now that, um, now because the other one had one. Um, but I was going to say, I feel like I don't actually like the protagonist of um, of Fates as much as the one from Awakening. No, I don't either. I find, I find the Fates protagonist very bland. Yeah, and it just, I don't like how everyone likes me so much. Mm. Like, let's have a bit of conflict. Come mm. on. Like, I don't want to be everyone's perfect sister. It's mm. a bit weird. So maybe D. Yeah... I can't speak for the boy one and their unique, nuanced story, but... Uh, okay. This lad... Thingy. Uh, Aza Azama? Azama, say? yes. Yeah. Um, I don't really like him that much. His whole thing is just kind of being patronising. Do we have another D I on our hands? I think we have another D on our hands. <laughs> okay, Azura. Mm, okay, I like Azura. I like Azura. She's good. Um, I think she's probably another A tier. Yeah, yeah, I, I, um, I'm fine with that. I this can't lad. remember who you are. Yeah, this is gonna. You know what might help? What? Get um Serenesforest dot net. Okay. Just and and just get the um the character like, go into Fates on the left hand menu and okay. um, go to the characters because I'm on it. I think it'll have portraits. Okay. Oh, even better. Okay. Uh, oh, unfortunately, I think they might be listed differently for the three roots. Uh, yeah, they are. Characters. Uh, so, just oh. introduction. Um, 
And yeah, if we just have them all open. Because we should okay. know at least which route people are from. Well, he's from Nor. Is yeah. he called Benny or something? Ben... Yeah, Benny sounds right. It's it's something with a B anyway. Uh. Uh, You'll need to keep going. Um, I was hoping it would be an alphabet. Okay, Benny. They're yeah. not, unfortunately. They're in order of introduction. Uh, he's... I mean, neither of us could remember his name for some so, time. <laughs> yeah, I think he's like a C. Probably, yeah. Um, this is... Baruka. Baruka. I don't like her that much. I actually really like her. Do you? Yeah. I, yeah. Did, I thought she was a boy for, like, the longest time. She's got a... She's got a surprisingly decent, um, story going on. Okay. With, like, um... Because there's a thing of, like, because she's a trained assassin and she's had to, like, basically try and switch off her emotions. Um... But, yeah, I think... As a compromise, I think she's probably something like a B... Okay. Like, I, because I, I probably would have put her in, like, an A. If it was... I would have put her in C, so let's okay. put her in B. B sounds perfect. Okay, Kyle Dory. Ah. This is Subaki's kid. Oh, right, yes. Um, I like her. Um. I have zero memory of her, so put her wherever you want. She has some kind of, like, Captain Carrot energies a little, okay. a little bit. She's not as funny, but she's very, like effortlessly perfect and stuff. Oh, uh, okay. I think she's probably a B. Okay. Um, she's kind of... I think she's cool. Ah, big oh, titty goth, goth <laughs> Onechan. E. <laughs> I don't like her. I mean, I, I'm i okay with her, but I, again, like Noe, I fully understand your reasons for not liking her, so... <laughs> um, this gal. Charlotte. Charlotte. E. I don't like her. Yeah, I don't either. Um, okay, so that is, I can't remember the name, but he was my son in one of my playthroughs, oh, so I really yeah. should. Oh, yeah. Um, I'll, I'll check. But, um, he is okay-ish. Uh, um, so, shared characters. Oh, he's not in shared characters. No, uh, the children are, like, at the, will be at the bottom. Okay. Dwyer. Okay. Ah. I don't like his name. No. I, I assume I didn't pick that. <laughs> uh, I think he's probably like a C. Fair enough. Even right. though he is my he, he is my son, but he is one of my the less favoured of my sons. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, he is he is the Cordelia of your children. <laughs> no. Cordelia in a King Lear sense, not That's the... like the opposite of it though, isn't it? Well like yes and no. The it depends how you look at it, really. Okay. She's his favourite child, but she's also the one who gets essentially disinherited. True. Anyway. Effie. Yes. I like her. I quite like I her, I think actually, she should yeah. be a B. Yeah, I think that's fair. I do find it funny how her armour does not cover her butt. Oh, yeah. Um. I mean, there's some <laughs> eccentric armour design in this game. <laughs> like, the, the butt is, of course, the most intrinsically strong part well, of the of the human body and it, therefore needs no it, it certainly is for me <laughs> um, okay the, the the two maids the maid sisters um you can tell they're sisters because they have the exact same face i think the first one is the one that you get throughout the game if you're yeah. the um she's all right she's fine she'd be like a c okay c the other one Probably also a C. Yeah. I have no strong feelings about either. One of them is called but... Felicia. Felicia is the pink hair one. Okay. Flora is the other oh, one. Oh, right. Okay. This is another one of my sons. Oh, okay. I got to check up on my son's name real quick. Um, He is... Oh, no. I'm on the Hoshiden room. Yeah, That's I was going to say. Um... Um, his name is... Oh, Forrest. Forrest. <laughs> I love all my children equally. <laughs> Earlier that same day, I don't much care for the ones whose names I can't remember. <laughs> um, C. I, yeah. Uh, okay, Gunter. I'm sus I kind of like Forrest, but I'm suspicious of his character design. Oh, me too. Anyway, Gunter and D. S C. Mm, C. I'll put him on a C. Okay. I kind of like the vague Barristan Selmy vibe he's got going on. Okay, the next one's Hannah, right? Hannah, yeah. I, I like, like Hannah a lot. Me too. Uh, I'd say she's probably an A for I me. Think, I think that's a good shout. I think that's exactly where she should be. Oh, it's this kid. What's his name? Uh, 
annoying child. The wind tribe kid. Yeah. Um, where's he at? Hayato. Hmm. I should really just have this on the Revelation one because that will have all of. Oh no, it doesn't. It might not. Oh, they just don't show me. There are. I guess there aren't any exclusive characters. No. Okay. Anyways, um, I don't care for him. Nah. D. Yeah, probably a D. Uh, oh, Hinata. Uh, has good. the same name as the protagonist from Danganronpa 2, and that's why I remember it. See? Yeah, that's what I think. Fair enough. Ah, Hino an interesting character. Hinoka. I just looked her up. That's how I remember what her name is. Oh, no, I remembered. Okay. Uh, I, I like her a lot, actually. Uh, I think she might be an A for me. Yeah, I think she's pretty cool. She's the the, the the siblings you get on the Hoshiden and Rue are vastly superior. <laughs> yes, I would agree. <laughs> um, this kid. Uh, what's his name? Hmm. Uh, he one of it's... his personality traits is he likes pickles. I remember that. He's Sami. He's Sami. <laughs> he likes pickles. Sure. Um, he's one of the children that I like better, but that's not saying oh, that right. much. I, so maybe C. I don't know if I ever even got him. Oh, he is Subaki's kid. He's um, Hinata's oh, he's kid. Hinata, Hinata's kid. That's what I meant. I'm just mixing everyone <laughs> up. That's Benny's kid, I think. The oh, okay. One. Um, the so... one who looks like um, some kind of Final Fantasy antagonist. Yeah, exactly. Um, his name is Ignatius, which is a very good name. That is a good name. I mean, that might, like, raise him a tear, honestly. But he's kind of like a nothing boy. Yeah. He's like, uh, if I recall correctly, so I think he's probably like a C or a D. Probably a D, honestly. Okay. I'm going to make a prediction now, by the way. I think C is going to be by far our most populated yeah. tier. Okay, so... The Jacobs. Yeah, the as Jacob you can twins. see, this is my, this is my, my butler, my anime butlers. Yeah. Um, Lorenz Helm and Gloucester. So, this is the most favoured of my spouses okay. for these games. And Fair for enough. that reason, I would like to recommend that he be placed in the A or the S tier. I mean, look, you know him better than I do, so I think... He's my spouse. He did a little... Oh, maybe one in one, <laughs> one, one in each. Yeah, yeah, perfect. <laughs> um, furry. <laughs> oh, I kind of like him. Caden. Actually, so do I. <laughs> um, I like him. I want him to go in the A tier, actually. Okay. Yeah. I can't remember that. if I... I didn't... I don't think I did marry him because it was just too weird. That'd be a bit much, yeah. It was, although you'll see later on that I did not draw the line in some other quite reasonable places. Okay. Oh, um, oh actually, I know what you mean. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, uh, so that is another one of the ninja. Yeah, I can't... K Kagero? Yeah, Kagero. Uh, she's pretty cool, actually. Mm, yeah, I quite like her. But she's probably still only a C. Yeah, she's a high she's C. She's a high C. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, our children. Okay, do you want to rank your child first, and then I'll rank my child, seeing as we've got our sure. respective children's. I quite like Khan, although I don't like her nearly as much as Morgan, but I think she's still probably an A for me. Uh, I think that Kana probably also an A. Fair enough. For my... For oh, my... no, that's oh, Kaze. No. Speaking of which, um, I'm a fan of his, actually. I quite like him. Uh, uh, I considered marrying him, but that was mostly because his kid is really sweet and I wanted her mm, to be my kid. She is. Um, but I didn't. Um, maybe, like, a, he'd probably be an A, actually. Okay. I was going to say B, but I think that's fair enough. This is Keaton. Oh, yeah. Cool name. Cool name. Uh, I don't yeah. like him as much as Caden. No. But he's, he's all right. He's maybe, like, a B. Or a C. I I would have put him in as as a C. Uh, let's go with a let's let's go with a C. Yeah. Seeing as Kagero is there as well, and I like them probably about the yeah. same. Yeah. So this is Takumi's kid, right? Yes. Uh, his name is something beginning with an I, I think. Um. Uh, it'll be under exclusive children. Oh God. Uh, oh no, it's Kiragi. Kiragi. It's okay. not beginning with an I. Uh. There's an I in it. In fact, there's two. Uh, yeah, but I can't really have that as a winning qualification out of, like, five vowels. See? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Uh, I, I kind of like how the kids in this game are, like, a bit younger than the kids in Awakening. Yeah, me that's too, kind actually. Of cute. I, think I like the, the difference, even though I also think there should not be kids in this game. Yeah. I overall don't like any of them as much as the kids in the other game, and I do think it's tacked on and silly. Yes, there, there are a couple that I really like, but uh, I don't think I like any of them as much as Owain or Cynthia. 
Okay, this is the game where he's called Laszlo, right? Yeah. I don't like him. No. Nah. Deary. <laughs> <laughs> probably a, uh, probably an E, actually. Okay. Would you have gone D? I probably would have gone D. Okay, let's put him in D. Maybe I'm being too harsh. I don't like him either, but I don't think I dislike him. Okay, so... <laughs> ah. Your brother husband. Yeah. <laughs> My brusband. <laughs> What's his? Is he called Leo? Leo, yeah. Okay. Um, also voiced by uh, Max Mittelman, who plays Ryuji. Yeah, although they don't sound very similar no, at all. He's very different in each. Probably an A. I feel I. I don't feel good about mm. having a brother husband. <laughs> hey, look! I've got my own shame that we will get. Okay, to. okay, okay. Um, Midori. Yes. Oh, she's so cute. Oh. I think she'd probably be an A for me. Yeah, I think she should be an A. Uh, she looks cute with green hair, actually. Although yeah. I guess oh, it's, I guess they've just put them all with the father's hair. That's color. just the the like default hair. They've yeah. asexually reproduced them for this. Yes. This. Okay. Um. So that is what is her name? It's a uh, Azama's kid. I like her. Uh, Mitama. Mitama. Uh, I actually think she is fun. She's the poet one. Oh, yeah. But she has her, like, a little tablet, so it kind of looks like she's texting, which I assume is intentional, <laughs> but instead of being obsessed with her phone, she's, like, obsessed with writing haiku. I would kind of maybe want to put her... I don't like her as much as Midori, but I think maybe she's a B. Yeah. Okay. In terms of, like... But she's a high B for me, actually. I think she's very funny. <laughs> I'm not sure if I ever even got her, so I'll defer to you entirely. She's she's fun. I do like her. Interestingly, her hair is a different colour to yeah, I was wondering Azama's about that. there. But... Um, Mozu. Mozu's sweet. Yeah, I like her. I think I probably like her better than Donald, actually, given that she is like the equivalent. Yeah, I think she should probably go in A. Yeah. Not least because I had her be Midori's mum in one of my playthroughs, so I I'm, feel like it's... I'm surprised by how well populated A is, I'm not going to yeah. lie. Yeah. Uh, there are some good ones, but you know, are. look at this next garbage boy. It's Niles. D or E. He's not even garbage boy in like a fun no. way. I'm so, like I shouldn't I shouldn't abuse that title. I think he should probably be E. I he, I would have recommended E. Uh, um, that's his kid. What's her name? Oh, Nina. Okay, that explains why I don't recognize her. I like her. She's the like. <laughs> She's a bit of an oddball. She's the, like, um, the yaoi fan girl one. Ah. But I like her because I ship her with Soleil. That's interesting, not least because um, her uh, her dad is the only possible um, male marriage yeah. option if you're playing as a male character. And what a garbage option the, yeah. the same-sex ones are in this game. They sure are. We'll get to that in a bit. <laughs> But I think, for like what she's actually like, she should probably be a C. Yeah. But for how much I, I like her more than what the game really gives me to like. Mm, mm. You know, <laughs> uh, Nix. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Her name is Nix. Yeah. Uh. There's a bit of foreshadowing. She doesn't really have much of her whole thing. Is like, oh, I'm cursed to look young forever. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah, I know. It's um, a bit one of those. C. Probably a C. Yeah. I can't really bring myself to dislike her, and she does. She at least doesn't have the thing where she's what Noe has, where she's like, "I'm super mature and cool." Where she at least is mm. like, seems burdened by the years. <laughs> okay. Uh, Aro Yeah, that sounds right. Um, let me I just... actually quite like her. <laughs> I think she's funny. She's the one that's obsessed with. T well, she's like. Oboro. Oboro. She, like, really wants to impress Takumi, yeah. right? Yeah. She's kind of fun. For some reason. Uh, uh, B, I think. I, I would have said B, yeah. She's one of my favourite of the retainers. Obviously not as good as Hannah, but, like, well, <laughs> mm. she's really nice. Odin. Hannah reminds me, like, favourably of someone I went to university with. Ah. Yeah. Odin S. S tier. Yeah, I think that's fair. We can't S We can't. Put that boy that. right. <laughs> He's earned that place. My aching blood! <laughs> Okay, his kid. Mm, I don't uh, like her that much. I, I can't remember anything about um, her. Um, she's called like Ophelia, and oh, she's okay. basically just the same as him, but a girl. Ah. So she has a girl outfit on. Ah. That's it. Ah. So, I think. C D. 
I feel like C is probably fairest, but it's one of those ones where the disappointment that they aren't that interesting kind of makes me want to demote her, but I yeah. think C is probably best. Oh, what's this gal's name again? I'll have to check, but I... Uh, she's the, like, fortune teller. Yeah, I uh, should be up a bit higher. Orochi. Orochi. Oh, I think I was I was mixing her up with uh, Aboro. I quite like her. Yeah, I think she's maybe a B as yeah, well. Yeah, I think me. B is good. I she's, quite like her as well. I think she's pretty cool. I think I had her marry Rioma, actually. Oh, interesting. Uh, I think I had her marry Saizo in one, which is ah. kind of awkward because she's, like, BFFs with his ex. Oh, yeah. Um... But I, I, no, I, and I had her marry Azama in another one just because I figured they'd annoy each other and it was oh, funny. Oh, yeah. Okay, uh, Percy? Percy, yes. Um, I don't know. He's kind of cute, but also there's not that much to him. Maybe a C? C yeah. Okay, um, I don't Perry. like her. Perry. Yeah. Uh, e or D. D, I think. She's yeah. not quite as bad as the, as the E tier, but mm. she's very, like... She's so like MySpace. Yeah. It hurts me. Uh, oh, what's this girl's <gasps> yes. name? Is she I called like Seiko? Ray Seiko or something? Ray it can't be Seiko. Raina, I think. Ray that's yeah, that sounds Raina. right. Raina. I like her a lot. Yeah, I think she's she's either a B or an A for me. So Probably more a B. I think she should be a B, but only because she doesn't have supports with anybody apart from the protagonist, yeah. which I really don't like. Me because too. I, yeah. I want to see people interact with e with each other. Yeah. Um, I would have much preferred that that she could talk to at least a few other people. Yeah. Um, okay, Rajat. Oh, yeah. That's, that's her name. Yeah, I don't like her. Well, I, I, what I don't like is that she's like... She's just a clone of Tharja, obviously. Mm, yeah. But she's kind of a simplified version of Tharja as well. Yeah. Where she's got no reason to be the, like murderous goth that she is mm. and so it's just infuriating yeah so i would actually want her to be in d probably fair enough rinka oh i like rinka yeah me too i think she's probably an a oh okay b or an a i was gonna say b okay let's go b then right i don't like her as much as hannah and some of the other people yeah in the a -tier. i like how hannah is like the, the gold she standard is for she is the standard of a because i don't she's not really close to being an S, but she is, like, good. Yeah, I, I do I like, like, like her. her. Uh, I like Ryoma quite a bit as well, actually. I think he's probably a B or an A for me. Um, I think B is fair for yeah, Ryoma. I'm happy with that. Because um, I think that the two older brothers are kind of a bit lacklustre. Yeah. But they kind of have to be because of their roles in the story, and exactly, of the two, yeah. Ryoma is certainly the more... Speaking of two older brothers, by the oh way. Oh, God, why are they... Okay. I don't know. Saizo. Saizo. Uh, uh, C. Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> so now we get to my terrible confession, because I married Sakura not once but twice. Oh, so you married her in the Hoshido one. Uh, yeah, and in uh, Where you Revelation. don't know that she's not actually your sister. Well, I did, because I already knew. But she didn't know. We found out. Okay. Off screen. Oh god, that's. <laughs> well, you you can decide where to rank her based on your levels of shame. I feel no shame. <laughs> S for no shame. She is lovely. Yeah, no, I like her a lot. Um, uh, like, even aside from that, she, like she is outright one of my favorite characters. No, in the she's game. nice, and she manages to have the thing of being like shy. And, like, her thing being that she's kind of nervous around people, but without it being, like, really annoying and, like, overly cutesy shyness. Yeah. Because I don't like that thing where it's, like, a sort of cute kind of social awkwardness because it's, like, I don't know. Mm. Okay, Scarlet. Yeah. Um, C? I'm go I want her to be a D because she doesn't have supports of anyone apart from the protagonist. And okay, so... That pissed me off because I wanted to marry her to Ryoma. <laughs> Me too. D for doesn't have supports. It really felt like they should be able to get married. Yeah. And I'm gutted that they couldn't. Uh, Cornelia? Not Severa. Sever what no is her name? Not Severa is what I'm calling her. Okay. Uh, sh uh, D. Yeah. Um, okay. Caden's kid. Yeah. She's called Selkie, I think. Yes, that's right. Ah, uh, I like ended up liking her more than I was expecting to. 
Uh, but I think she's probably still maybe a C. Mm -hmm. um, but she is quite cool. I, I think I thought she was going to be more annoying than what she actually was. Mm. And Setsuna. I like her. I, I do like as Setsuna. well. I think yeah. she might be an A. Yeah. She's I was just, just very weird. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I find her very endearing. Yeah. yeah. I think I actually considered marrying her as well. Uh, she would have been a good choice. I like her. Um, okay, Shigure. Mm. Uh, he's fine. Yeah. <laughs> See? Probably he's not one of the like most bland children but he doesn't like inspire joy yeah i mean he does have a very very good map on, when, on the the chapter that you recruit him oh yeah he's got the one with the like ships moving around which, which is like one of my favorite maps in this here oh this is duke oliver's theme oh, this one blew he that his his recruitment map blew my mind i will mm. say yeah it's so good but um beauty is a mad mistress is what it's called well <laughs> Me. Anyway, sorry. Okay, so Shiro, I think, is that guy's name? Yeah, that That's sounds right. Ryoma's kid. Yeah. I quite like him. Mm, me too. Mostly because he reminds me of Raphael from Three Houses a little bit. Oh, yeah. I can um, see so I think he's probably a B. I would say, yeah. And gets me next to his dad. That's nice. Okay, the next one, that's Xander's kid, yeah. right? I don't like him. I can't remember his name. He's no, got a neither. mullet and I never got past that. Oh, no. And mullets are back in fashion now, but I'm not accepting it. No. Um, C? Uh, yeah, probably a C. Silas. Silas is pretty chill. I like Silas. I yeah. think Silas should maybe be in the A or the B tier. I would say he's a B for me. Okay. Soleil. Oh, yeah. So... I like Soleil, but I'm mad because you can't have her marry any of the girls, mm. which is like clearly what her whole personality is mm. geared towards. But you can marry her to boys. Mm. What is this? Mm. I mean, I know what this is, unfortunately. Okay, so I think C. Yeah. I actually like her more than that would suggest, but I feel betrayed by her role in the story is basically what that is. Mm. Uh, Sophie. Oh, Sophie's cool. I like Sophie, yeah. Sophie should be A tier. I would... Yeah, I, I'm happy with that. One of the few children to rank higher than their parents. Yeah. Takumi. Um, He's alright. I like that Takumi doesn't like the protagonist immediately. Yeah, I honestly I'm with him a little bit. <laughs> he is he is a voice of dissent and we ought to applaud him for this. Yeah. And so I am happy for him to be placed as high as necessary. Uh I don't think I can justify putting him in A, but I think he would be a high B. Okay, okay. I just like how he does he 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 doesn't just be like Oh my god, you're the best. I love you. I love what mm. you're doing. Almost uniquely in the game. He's like, you suck. And I'm yeah. like, you know what? I do. You, you're right, Takumi. You tell them. And by them, I mean me. <laughs> okay, that's... Um, Is that Keaton's kid? Yeah, what's her name? It begins with like a V or something, maybe. Yeah, well... Valuria. Ah. That's... Valoria. Yeah. Ah, that's a pixie song. Oh. I like her. I think she's... I like her design. Oh, yeah. Because she's like a wolf red riding hood. Yeah. I will kind of want to put her in B. Okay. Just because she's she's sweet. I'm not sure I ever got her, so I'll defer to you entirely. I got that. all of them. <laughs> all of them. <laughs> okay. Right, now there's even blander Oni-chan. Okay, well, he's got to go in C because he's blander than Both the previous of him. one. Both of him. Um. Okay. And now there's kind of creepy little sister. I don't, I don't like her. Yeah, I, I've actually completely forgotten her name. Um. Uh, God, I don't know. I mean, it's after X in the alphabet, so that should narrow it down. Uh. Let's check. Yeah, sure. Our beloved sister. Uh, you need to scroll down. Oh God, Elise. Oh. Ah, Elise. Okay, I guess they're not all alphabetical. They okay. all have been up to now. Okay, I don't like her. I would be happy putting her in E. Ooh. That is how much... I don't like the two Nurian sisters. I don't. All. I mean, I don't like her either, but for me, she's more of a D. Okay, I'll have... Um, you know what? She's not as, like, sexually aggressive as the other ones, well, so yeah. she can go in D. That's fine. Subaki. Yeah. 
I like Subaki. Also out of order. And C, B? I think B is fair. Okay. I like his dynamic with Hannah. Yeah, me too. Sakura's retainers. I think that's fun. Um, oh. Whoever this is. Oh, it's Thingy. The, like. Of course. You know, Thingy. He might not even. Oh, is it. Um, is his name actually Iago? It might be. <laughs> oh, God. How am I going to find it? It might not be in there. Cause he, uh, I think that might just be recruitable characters. Okay, well, I don't like him. like, But he's a villain, but he's not a very interesting one. Yeah. D. D, yeah. What is that? Is it the dragon? I guess. I can't even remember its name. Uh. Uh. D. Sure. Ah, it's an, it's an Anna. Uh, I don't really remember Anna in this game. I presume Neither she wasn't I. as, like, prominent. Or maybe she was in the, like, off-world battles bit. Maybe, yeah. I don't even remember her being in this game. E. Sure. Um, that's... Who is that? Who is that? I, I vaguely recognise them, but... Oh, it's, uh, she's in the Revelation one. She's, like, Azura, Azura's some kind of relation of Azura's or oh, something. Oh, okay. But I don't remember her, so D. D, okay. It's Awful Dad, E. <laughs> it's... I think he is an interestingly awful dad. Okay, but, yeah. do you want to move him up to be interesting? Sure. <laughs> Actually, no. I'll put, put it okay, up. I'm sorry. I was being harsh. It was just because... Uh, um, okay, so I, then... I do like that, like... All of the trailers for the game had him, uh, the, the thing from a cutscene of him being like, you're my child now. Just reaching his enormous hand towards the camera. Uh, but then the actual game just uses the 3D functionality to show Camilla's like boobies lunging towards Primarily, him. yeah, which is even more terrifying. Okay, I can't remember. Is that guy called Hans? <laughs> I can't remember. You ask me. I it? don't like him, E. Sure. Lilith! S. S. <laughs> Okay. She's cute and she protected me. <laughs> I'm not quite as fond of Lilith as you are. But... I like her design. She's so mm, cute. I do like her design. She doesn't have to be an S. She could be an A. Yeah, well, we we have few enough people in S. I okay. Think. Uh, that's... That's mom. Mom. But not... But is she? Is uh, she, she the one that's actually mom? She actually is. Okay. Um. C. Sure. And uh, yeah, she's not um, the biological mother of any of the Hoshiden children. Oh, okay. That's what it is. Okay, that's the that's the get out clause. Yeah. <laughs> okay, nice. Um, that's the dad of the Hoshiden children is the next one, is maybe? It? Or is it somebody else? So I'm just enjoying March of the Lion King. Here. Oh, there's some characters that they didn't actually bother to put on here that are recruitable, including the one one of the ones that I married in one of my playthroughs. The like guy with the black hair but the white patch on it. <laughs> Yeah, he was not. He was he was the least favored of my spouses. Oh, oh, I remember the badger lad. Yeah, is he called like Shuro or something? That's sure. Yeah, yeah, Shuro or Shuro or something. Yeah, it looks like he's from Peloton. Yeah, 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 yeah. that lad. Yeah, it wasn't a very interesting marriage. <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, yeah, I think this is King Sumeragi. Okay. Um, um, C. C. Dead before the game starts. Yeah. Then there's this advisory lad. Yeah, Yo, Yo, Yoshi something? Yeah, maybe, I, I think that, that sounds good. He's cool. recruitable in the Hoshiden route, so he should be in there somewhere. Right down the bottom of exclusive characters, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, because you don't get Yukimura. Yukimura, that's it. Um, bleh. C? C. Yeah. And this fun friend. <sighs> I think he's the one that you, like, save in the Hoshiden route and then he betrays you anyway or something. He's just some This random... lad betrays us? <laughs> but he's got such a trustworthy face. Well, blind protagonist certainly thought so, if I recall correctly. Yeah, sure. Uh, D. Yeah, fair enough. Okay. We did it. And yeah, uh, C is the most populated tier. Let's see who... Let's see what the people... By love. a whole line, in fact. Which are the ones we want to look out for to see if other people have bad taste? Oh, well, everyone in S tier. Everyone in S tier. Okay. <laughs> Our two Jacobs. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, whoa. Oh, everyone has terrible taste. Oh, no. What's what's Elise and Camilla doing in S tier? You know what they're doing there. No, Nothing I don't. Good. I don't like it. Oh, and Niles as well. Oh. At least Sakura's Ooh. there. Oh, and we didn't right. mention it, but Raja is the girl that you can marry if you play as a girl. Yeah. And it's a terrible option. Yeah. Wait, this is completely different from... Oh, well, Sakura is in the top tier still. So. Yeah. Um, Where's and I'm, of... I'm not see. mad at, like, some of the options in S tier. Um... Uh, mm, I, I don't like... I'm surprised Takumi's up there, actually. Yeah. I, uh, I thought people generally didn't like him. Um, what is my anime butler doing in C tier? And what is my other anime <laughs> butler doing in D tier? <laughs> clearly. Clearly incorrect. Hmm. Okay. Um, okay. Well, let's, I let's, feel like... Let's leave this a lot of people graveyard of taste behind. Let's leave this anime bullshit. Oh, Hannah was in A tier, so at least that's correct. Okay, that is correct. She is lovely. Okay, our final one then. Yay! Do we need to change the music? Uh, we can do. Or we could just keep it. No, um, let's, let's change it. Um, so, and now for something completely different. Kind of. Uh, somewhat, at least. Um, I okay. have to change it, haven't I? Um, singles. Oh, that's nice. This is actually uploaded by the the ah. developers themselves as well. Okay. Oh. Actually, we're not going to get through the whole soundtrack by any means, so let's fast forward to something. Okay. Um, um, you know the track names better than me, I think, because well, you've we'll, listened to the soundtrack. We'll go for Heads of Hades first. Okay. Ah. Oh. Okay. That's OBS. Right, okay. Oh, God, we're going to have to zoom in a bit more. I had to zoom out because oh, there were so I many I really people. wish that people would just do the head and shoulders of the characters. Yeah, well, I can tell. you can tell who all of them are. Because, I can tell who Aphrodite is from, ha that, from that section. Well, yeah, well, because Hades has such good character design that yeah, everyone is instantly recognisable. Oh, this is going to be a bit of a weird one because these are in alphabetical order as well. Not entirely. Oh, they're not. No. Um, okay. I mean, Zagreus is there. And oh the, yeah. The, I think these have just been just the afterthought characters. For oh some no. Reason. That's well. That's that's wrong because I like all of those a lot. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. So, yeah. Well, we'll go through them in the order. Okay. So Achilles. Uh, so Achilles suffers from my association of him with the mythological Achilles, who is a shit lord. Mm. Um. Let's see. Yeah, I, I would put him in the C. Electo. <laughs> B? Yeah. She's funny. She is fun. Trash god. Uh, Aphrodite. Um, I'd say Aphrodite is my least favourite of the Olympians, probably. Oh, really? Yeah. She's not my oh, least no, favourite. Oh, no, sorry. No, she's not my least favourite. She's next up from my least favourite. OMG, couple who is coming goals, soon. I assume. Yes. <laughs> Um, you assume gra Oh wait, no. no. I don't like Zeus either. But yeah, that's I just, just cause... So I just remembered Zeus somehow. Yeah. But I'm not a huge fan of most. I like the weakening effect, but otherwise I'm not a huge fan of her boons as well. Mm. She is very sexy. She is. Well, she's naked, which is the main. That's thing. like part of the way that B anyway. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or do, were you going to go lower? I'd go C for her. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, I'll yeah. tell you what, we go... So, cause I think sometimes it can help to have more of a, an idea of what you're dealing with with the early ones. Yeah. So. Aries. Uh, C. Yeah, that's, that's fair enough. Artemis. Oh. Oh, she's good. I think she... I. She's definitely my favourite of the Olympians. I think I would mount an argument for S. I think she should probably go in the S tier. With There might be another Olympian that I make the case for, but she should definitely be there. I mean, speaking of the S tier... Oh my god, Asterius, put that boy right in the S tier. It's where he deserves to be. <laughs> I can see some others coming up soon. I love him. Okay, Athena, this is who I would also like to be in the S tier. Yeah, I was vacillating between S and A for her. It's a combination of the fact that her boons are so flippin' useful. Yeah. Not a huge fan of the cast, mm. but the attack and the... Um, the attack or the special, depending on what weapon you're using, and the... Um, the dash. The dash. The dash is, her dash is my most used boon. 
I'm um, not a huge fan of her aid either, I will say. Yeah. I think the thing is that like her design is is some of them I like the designs because they are different and exciting from what I expected. Mm. But I like hers because it's like such a good encapsulation of what I imagine Athena to be like in I, mythology. I would say the same for Artemis actually. Yeah. So I I would I would like her to be an S. Okay, you... I'm happy, I'm happy for her to be S. I think here I think S is going to be our most credited tier. Uh, yeah, it I'm might not going to lie because look who's coming up next. This is freaking Baldy. I love that boy. Cerberus. I love that boy. No discussion necessary. Oh, Chaos. Chaos. Actually, should we try and decide for Aphrodite now? I think Aphrodite is... Mm, I'm going to say Aphrodite is a B, actually, because yeah. I do enjoy my encounters with her. She's... <laughs> uh, she's fun. Chaos. Chaos. Nah. I think Chaos might be a B as well. Uh, yeah, I was going to say B or an A, just because I really like their design. Their design is great, and also, I think... Like, this is probably the only thing based on Greek mythology that I've ever come across that does something interesting with chaos. So... I think that, like, also, I, I do find it fun taking the, like, the, the, the boons from them. Yeah. It's like, so I would like to have A, but I'm, I'm happy to settle for B if you really don't want to push them up that high. You know what, we, A is unpopulated at the moment, let's go for it. Yeah. And, you know, they love those unpopulated places. Well, exactly. S. <laughs> no. So Karen's obviously beautiful anyway, hmm. but also the fact that um, Zagreus and some other characters pronounce his name the same as Kieron is just so funny. Hmm. Looks like Kieron's going to want all this. <laughs> Grandma. Grandmama. A. Uh, oh yeah, I was going to say. Mom of mom. Oh, it's the grandparents' tier. That's oh, so Oh yeah, nice. it is. Oh my god. Uh, Dionysus. <laughs> Why hey, Matt Berry? Zach. Well, he kind of is. <laughs> he is thing. a bit, yeah. His voice is a little bit Matt Berry. Um, uh, I'm just gonna choose the music. I think I think B for Dionysus. I was gonna say B as well. I yeah. do like him, but not. I think I like him about the same as Aphrodite is the thing. Okay, I'd, I'd say I like him slightly more. Okay. Um, well, I, I think I like Aphrodite more than you, so... Yeah. Deusa. I'd say Deusa's a. Either, either an A or an S for me, I'd say. Probably more an A. I really like her. Yeah, me too. When you're looking at Baldy, though... I mean... Baldy is round. the summon that I... Is the, like, the companion that I use. Yeah. Okay, so it's Troubled ah, Dad. Yeah. I'd say Hades probably a B for me. I think he, I, I think it's a really interesting take on Hades mm. as a character, and I think he's a much more nuanced character than he seems at first. Mm. I think I, I really like the way he evolves and develops over the course of the game. Mm. Um, so yeah, I'd say, I'd say probably a B. No, yeah, sure. It. I'm I'm happy with that. I would have probably gone C or B, but I, I think that for interestingness, B. Hmm. I think maybe A for Hermes. Yeah, I like it. He was I. So I wasn't too sure about him at first, but I really come around to him. I think mm. he's a laugh. Mm. And I like how he has the very like Greek mythology Hermes thing of seeming to have to do any other duties commensurate yeah. with the role. <laughs> but he works with like Karen and. Skelly, mm. so you know, I mean, comes highly recommended. Beautiful by association. <laughs> D. On the other hand, yeah, Hypnos is like maybe the closest to a character I actually don't like in the game. I think it's, I think it's, a, I'm okay with it because I think that he's kind of supposed to be a bit annoying when he's mm. being like, just try not running at things. Mm. <laughs> but I still. I feel like if somebody has to go in that category, it yeah. may as well be him, really. Meg. Oh, Meg A. Okay. I like Meg. Yeah, I'm okay with Where that. were you going to... I was, would have said B, but I'm... Uh, like, she would have been a high B, so I'm happy with A. She's cool. Ah, uh, Nyx. Nyx. Other mom. Mm. Oh, Nyx is very cool. Hmm. I, again, another maybe one. Maybe an A? I love her design. I think maybe an A for her, actually. Yeah, happy with that. Um, uh, yeah, her design is cool. Right? Uh, I, I think she's got some interesting stuff going on over the course of the game. Yeah. Uh, Patroclus, sad boyfriend. 
Um, B. B? Yeah. I, I definitely like him better than Achilles. Yeah, and I kind of like their take on his character, and I mm. do really like... I like his... I like his design, and I like how his and Achilles' designs kind of complement each other. Yeah, yeah. But I don't think that there's so much to him that no. I like him any more than the B tier. Yeah. Mom. S. Mom. I would agree. I like, obviously, Mom. Mm. But also, I I think it's a it's a really good take on Persephone. Um, and like, good... I'm always a fan of good takes on Persephone. I just... It was so... The first... When I finally reached her... Mm. The tears. <laughs> okay. I, I like that that's um, surface Persephone as well, rather than... Or yeah, Persephone. I like that look on her. I think I prefer that, but I understand that she needs her, like, Hades regalia. Yeah. Beside... Uh, A. Yeah, I was struggling between B and A, but I think I'd probably bump him up. He is a, he such is a laugh. Fun. Like, I... I... I don't know. He's just like a party boy, and mm. I love that. Mm. Skelly. S2. <laughs> you think? <laughs> he is for me. Okay. I'm, but he can go A. I would have put him A. I, have I don't to like him as much as some of the people. That's the thing. Year. Like, I, I do like him, but I don't like him as much as any of these. Okay. So I love Skelly. He is fun. Suck it to me, boy <laughs> <laughs> Now, here's the thing. I'm not a huge fan of Thanatos. Um, I know you are. Well, not... And if not a huge fan, at least, well, I mean, your Zagreus is. Yeah, although my Zagreus, he's um, he's been up, he's been up to some stuff. Well, yeah. Uh, I think I would, I would want him to go in the A tier. Okay. Because he's a Drow legend. For me, he's probably more like C, so maybe we could uh, pop okay, him in B. B as a compromise. I think that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I was going to say A or S, because I don't like him as much as Asterius. I don't like him as much as Asterius but either, so but he's funny. so much fun. Okay, yeah, he's I think got he it. has okay, to be okay, S. Okay, okay. <laughs> Tiffany. C. Uh, yeah, yeah. She, I don't know, she's fun, but obviously, for for obvious reasons, there's not necessarily that much to her. Mm. Zag. C or a D. <laughs> Zaggy boy. Um, We've talked about this before on, on other streams, but I don't think either of us are huge fans of Zag. I think C. Yeah, I think yeah. He's, he's not bad. No, but he's not. He is there as a conduit to meet the other characters who are more interesting. Yeah. Uh, C for Zeus. Yeah, or like D, honestly, for his shitbaggery. But the problem is, his shitbaggery is mostly external to That's the game. True. Okay, C, C. So I love her design. Yes. I think probably A at least. I would put her in A. Yeah. I really like Eurydice. I think Me she's too. she's I love her like tattoo vibes. Yeah. I didn't she is one where like I didn't know what to expect from her character yeah. design, but it was like everything I didn't know that I needed. Mm. Orpheus, I would put it a B, I think. I like him as well, but I definitely prefer Eurydice. I think they both have really cool designs. I think they both have great designs, yeah, but for sure. I think he's definitely lower than her because yeah. I like Eurydice more. So maybe a C or a B. I'd, oh, well, okay. What did you say, B? I'd say B. I think B. B is yeah. fair. Sisyphus A. Okay, I was wondering where you're going to go A or S. But, um... I feel like Baldi is more S tier, and I think that he would appreciate that. Okay, so if Baldi and Cerberus at least are not S tier, then... Everyone is wrong. What what are our predictions? I think Than is going to be S tier in the community rank. Probably. Um, uh, I think Ares is going to be a lot higher, and Zag and Achilles are going to be a lot higher up than we've put them. I don't know about Ares. Zag and Achilles, yes. Um, ah, see, you know, I I'm I'm predicting Ares is going to. We'll see. We'll okay. see. I think you have a better take on the fandom than me okay, okay well immediately wrong obviously oh my god unless people are doing that as like a fun prank on him yeah yeah that baldy and c tier people are wrong well clearly also skelly uh, wait why is this why is hypnos higher 
Why is Demeter in C tier? I don't know. She's your grandma, hmm. Zagreus. Who's where is Zagreus? S tier. Yeah, S tier along with all of his potential bows. Uh, Persephone isn't in S tier. Hmm. That's very wrong. Like Artemis and Athena are. Yeah, and I'm not mad about like the other. Um, and they've got Eurydice there. Yeah. Obviously, yeah, Schnurberus okay. made it to yes. the to the heights. So I I actually. The ST is not as shocking. It's more the people that didn't that mm. didn't get didn't get all the way up there, you know? Hypnos is weirdly high as well. Yeah. Same tier as Asterius? I don't think so. Wait, what is Asterius doing in the B tier? He's He's one of the champions of Elysium. <laughs> you guys. Anyway. That's a bit of a bombshell to be honest with mm. you. Mm. How many people have done this? 40, oh, 40, I think it's yeah. there. It did, yeah. Hmm. Now, if we look again at the correct ranking. Yes. <laughs> oh, perfect. Hmm, hmm. The only thing is, maybe Deusa, maybe we should have put Deusa in S tier now that I'm thinking about it. You know what? I, I, can, I can get behind that. Like, I, I've i thought about it, and I think she actually does so much for the House of Hades. Hmm, hmm. And is adorable. I'm just... I feel like... You've got a beautiful complementary oh, sort of yeah. row here. Mm, mm. Obviously, she is dusting Baldy, and then she's going to cle to um, feed Cerberus. Hey, that's so. nice, actually, because I don't think she has. She, she doesn't get actually get to interact with Baldy, but I mm. feel like they would really, they'd really hit it off. I, mean, I think Bal so. <laughs> Baldy. Apparently, some people don't like Baldy, but Baldy, he's charisma or clock. Mm, mm. I love that boy. The way he just drops out of the sky and gives me snacks. Mm, I like how he believes in me. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> I like to give him nectars. So, um, this time next week we will be doing something slightly different again. Yep. Uh, we will be doing our first Animal Crossing stream for a while. Mm -hmm. um, it's mostly just to kind of um, check in with the island. There's not anything particular going on and also to be another kind of in-between stream before we start our next like full playthrough in this slot yes um then in the meantime um as usual we will have uh King kingdom hearts 2 mm -hmm. on friday uh back to the tron world oh my god and um then persona persona 5 royal on monday yeah um so this was a lot of fun it's mm. nice to do something a bit like more chatting based every now yeah and then. yeah for sure um hopefully you enjoyed it and if you'd like to join us for some more streams that would be cool all right bye for now bye bye